This movie tells a story about a pilot who finds himself caught in a war zone after he's forced to land his commercial aircraft during a terrible storm. This movie is really mediocre. It's dull, plodding, and really generic action movie. The movie offers nothing new as it hits all the usual action movie bits with very little excitement. It's tedious, shallow, and takes itself too seriously. The familial stakes are typical for an action film like this. Unfortunately, the script never takes these stakes to high altitude after getting you on board. The dialogue is stilted, and the characters are one-dimensional caricatures who are just there to move the plot forward. The film never even gives these stock stereotypes anything of interest to do. Not only are the heroes uninteresting, but the villains are as well. Gerard Butler, who plays the pilot, has nothing memorable to say or do. The movie tries to paint him as a wild hero type who cannot be held back, but it never lets that version of the character get off the ground. The film never does anything interesting with Louis as well, who is the prisoner who decides to help the passengers. Rather than explore his morality, question his choices, and delve into his complex backstory, the movie reduces him to just a guy with a gun. This makes his actions essentially meaningless because his motivations are vague at best. The passengers are particularly trifling characters, grounded solely by the pilot's determination to save them. When trouble befalls them, it's hard to care much because there's so little personality there to invest in. To make it worse, this movie doesn't offer compelling and memorable antagonist with an understandable goal. Instead, we have a conveyor belt of evil people doing evil things and none stand out above the rest. When you have a lifeless set of heroes and villains like in this movie, the big finale feels really bland. The movie has very little going for it when it comes to its production values. There's no picturesque scenery to compensate for the lack of visual style. The same can be said about the action scenes, which are not very exciting or thrilling. This movie never takes the action scenes up a notch, giving you bland action sequences and kills that lack creativity or brutality. Overall, this movie is not worth your time. We do not recommend this movie at all.